a huge update. This is 3i Atlas. That's a comet. It does not have a very big, very noticeable cometary tail. Here's the problem. 3i Atlas is behaving like no comet we've ever seen, and the scientific community can't agree on why. This Manhattan-sized interstellar visitor should have a massive glowing tail after passing close to our sun. But instead, it's completely tailless while experiencing mysterious acceleration that suggests something is pushing it through space. Disintegrate to a very dense and massive cloud of gas and dust that is pushed away from the sun by the solar radiation. You're frustrated because mainstream sources aren't giving you the full picture of what this means for our understanding of the universe. The solution. I've analyzed every major study on 3i Atlas, about to break down the three leading scientific theories, including the controversial one that suggests this object might not be entirely natural. Subscribe to Space Aquarius, and let's begin. Harvard astrophysicist Dr. Avi Loeb calls it a potential black swan event that could change our understanding of what's really out there. The object brightened seven times faster than any normal comet turned bluer than the sun itself, and NASA's own data now shows it's experiencing mysterious non-gravitational acceleration. Something is pushing it through space. 3i Atlas might be an artificial object or even a probe from another civilization because of its strange chemical makeup and trajectory. Three spacecraft captured images during its closest solar approach, and what they found has scientists scrambling for explanations that don't involve the word natural. What makes 3i Atlas particularly unsettling is its 16.16 hour rotation period, a slow, methodical spin that suggests this object has remained structurally intact during what must have been an epic 7 billion year journey through interstellar space. Most objects tumbling through the cosmic void for that long would have been shattered by gravitational encounters or cosmic collisions. Yet this visitor arrived at our doorstep spinning with clockwork precision. But here's where things get really strange. As 3i Atlas approached the sun, it should have started behaving like every other comet we've ever studied. Sunlight heats the surface, ice turns to gas, and that escaping vapor creates the classic glowing tail that makes comets so spectacular to watch. It's basic physics that's worked the same way for billions of years. Instead, 3i Atlas did something unprecedented. It brightened dramatically without producing a visible tail. The James Webb Space Telescope and ground-based observatories watched this chunk of ice and rock light up like a Christmas tree. But there was no streaming debris, no glowing gas cloud, no dust trail marking its path through space. Dr. David Jewett from University of California, who discovered the first object in the Kuiper Belt, analyzed the spectroscopic data and found something equally puzzling. The comet's composition showed familiar materials, water vapor, carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, but in completely wrong proportions. The carbon dioxide to water ratio hit 8 to 1, one of the highest ever recorded in any comet. Most solar system comets show ratios closer to 1 to 1. The Southern African Large Telescope and Nordic Optical Telescope captured spectroscopic readings that revealed another anomaly. 3i Atlas showed a distinctive reddening in the 400 to 700 nanometer range with a spectral slope of 22.8% per micrometer, indicating the presence of organic rich materials typically found in objects from the outer reaches of star systems. This suggests the comet formed in conditions vastly different from anything in our solar neighborhood. It's like comparing a rock from the Sahara Desert to one found at the bottom of the Arctic Ocean. The chemical fingerprints are completely different. The telescope readings showed that 3i Atlas reflects light in a way that's much redder than normal, almost like finding soil that looks rusty when everything nearby is gray sand. That reddish tint means it's covered with organic-rich materials, the kind we usually see on objects formed far from any star, in cold, dark regions of space. Then came the color change. As 3i Atlas passed through the sun's corona on October 29th, something extraordinary happened. Solar coronagraphs captured images showing the object glowing blue, not the typical yellowish or reddish hue we expect from reflected sunlight bouncing off comet dust. Blue light from a comet suggests active gas emissions like ionized carbon monoxide getting excited by solar radiation. But the real bombshell dropped when NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory updated their orbital calculations. 
For five months, three I Atlas had followed a perfectly predictable path based purely on the sun's gravity. Then everything changed in late October. Navigation engineer David Fernocchia had to add two new parameters to explain the object's behavior, a one and a two values that describe non-gravitational forces acting on the comet. Translation, something was giving 3i Atlas a push. The acceleration was tiny, just a few hundred miles per day squared, but it was definitely there. Here's the problem with that explanation. If normal outgassing caused this acceleration, 3i Atlas would need to lose massive amounts of material to generate enough thrust. Dr. Avi Loeb calculated that the object would have a half-life of about six months at this rate of mass loss. That means it should be shedding enough material to create a vast, glowing plume, visible to every major telescope on Earth. ESA's JUICE spacecraft, currently positioned with a perfect view of the comet's trajectory, should have detected this debris cloud by now. The Hubble Space Telescope, the James Webb Space Telescope, and hundreds of ground-based observatories all had clear shots at 3i Atlas throughout November. None of them found the expected mass loss. The mystery deepens when you consider the comet's dust mass loss rates, which astronomers measured at between 0.7 to 9.3 pounds per second. For a typical comet, this level of activity should produce spectacular visual effects streaming tails, glowing comas, and debris clouds stretching millions of miles. Yet 3i Atlas maintained what researchers describe as an asymmetric coma morphology, with no clear tail structure suggesting the presence of unusually large dust grains that resist being swept away by solar radiation pressure. So what's really happening here? The scientific community has proposed several explanations, each more intriguing than the last. Theory 1 dust-poor composition. Maybe 3i Atlas formed in a region of space where dust was scarce, leaving it with mostly volatile gases that don't create visible tails. The problem? Even gas-rich comets typically produce some dust when they heat up. Theory 2. Invisible outgassing. Perhaps the comet is venting gases like carbon dioxide that don't glow in visible light. These emissions could provide the thrust we're detecting without creating the spectacular light show we expect. But this doesn't explain the dramatic brightening or the blue coloration. Theory 3. Viewing Angle Earth might be positioned in exactly the wrong spot to see the tail, even if it exists. Comet tails always point away from the sun due to solar wind pressure, so our perspective could be hiding the debris stream. However, multiple spacecraft from different positions should have caught glimpses of any significant tail. Theory 4. The controversial one. Dr. Loeb suggests we consider the possibility that 3i Atlas might not be entirely natural. The combination of precise planetary alignment, unusual acceleration, lack of visible mass loss, and blue coloration creates a pattern that doesn't match any known comet behavior. Recent analysis by researchers using NASA's SphereX Infrared Space Telescope revealed even more anomalies. The comet showed strong water ice absorption and an extended carbon dioxide coma that stretched much farther than expected. This suggests internal heating beyond what solar radiation alone could provide. What's particularly striking is the detection of nickel in the comet's gas plume, an element more commonly associated with industrial alloys than natural space rocks. The Very Large Telescope in Chile confirmed this finding, along with the presence of cyanide in similar abundances to what we see in solar system comets. This chemical cocktail suggests three I Atlas formed in a stellar environment with metallicity levels comparable to our own sun. Chinese spacecraft Tianwen-1, orbiting Mars, managed to capture images of three I Atlas during its solar passage. The photos show a compact, glowing object with what appears to be an asymmetric coma the cloud of gas and dust surrounding the nucleus. But again, no clear tail structure. The European Space Agency's Mars Express and ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter also photographed the comet from their unique vantage points near the red planet. These images confirmed the object's unusual brightness and compact appearance, but they raised new questions about its internal structure. The object's current trajectory takes it on a hyperbolic path that will carry it past Jupiter's orbit in March 2026, offering another opportunity for detailed observation. 
Unlike typical comets that return on predictable schedules, 3i Atlas is making a one-time visit to our solar system before disappearing forever into the cosmic dark. The Vera C. Rubin Observatory, which begins operations at the end of 2025, is expected to discover one interstellar object per year once it reaches full capacity. If 3i Atlas represents a new class of interstellar visitor, we might be seeing the first of many such mysterious objects. What makes this discovery particularly significant is the sheer speed of 3i Atlas. At 36 miles per second, it's moving fast enough to cross the entire Milky Way galaxy in less than a billion years. That velocity suggests it's been wandering through interstellar space for an incredibly long time, possibly 7 billion years or more, encountering multiple star systems and receiving gravitational boosts along the way. The object's estimated size of 3.5 miles long makes it substantial enough to survive such an epic journey while retaining its structural integrity. Most smaller objects would have been torn apart by tidal forces or collisions during such an extended voyage through space. Ground-based observations continue to track 3i Atlas as it moves away from the Sun, and the data keeps getting stranger. The object maintains its brightness longer than models predict, suggesting either an internal heat source or a composition unlike anything in our solar system. The implications extend far beyond astronomy. If 3i Atlas represents technology from another civilization, it would be the first confirmed artificial object from interstellar space. If it's natural but behaves unlike any known comet, it tells us that planet formation around other stars creates objects with properties we've never encountered. Carl Sagan once calculated that if every star in the Milky Way ejects a thousand comets into interstellar space over 4.5 billion years, there could be millions of interstellar objects wandering the galaxy, more than the number of stars in the observable universe. At least 10,000 such objects are estimated to be passing through our solar system at any given time, invisible to our current detection methods. The scientific community remains divided, but one thing is certain. 3i Atlas has fundamentally challenged our understanding of what interstellar objects should look like and how they should behave. Whether it's an exotic natural phenomenon or something more extraordinary, this mysterious visitor has given us a front row seat to one of the most intriguing cosmic mysteries of our time. As we await additional observations and data from spacecraft throughout the solar system, 3i Atlas continues its silent journey toward the outer planets, carrying its secrets with it into the vast darkness beyond. Hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to catch our upcoming analysis of the December 19th observations. We'll have exclusive footage and expert interviews you won't find anywhere else. Drop a comment below with your theory about what 3i Atlas really is. I will read them all and share this video with anyone who loves unsolved cosmic mysteries. The universe just got a lot more interesting.